Chicago, Chicago. Another 72 and 72. Go all the way. All right, we're on the green. This place is epic. They invented the dip dish pizza. Mine is that one. Yes, Mine looks great. tragic. The first 36, first yeah. day of 72, 72. It's been an action-packed day. Day two. 5.30 in the morning. We are back in the Avis rental, but we're in Wisconsin. First time in Wisconsin for me. This is the first time I played golf in Wisconsin. Okay, well, what better way to play golf in Wisconsin than to play Aaron Hills, home of the 2017 US Open. Very famous track, known for being a little long and a lot of difficult. This is pretty cool. They've got a little putting course there. Look how much undulation is in this. Good morning. Good morning. Hey Avery, I'm Steve. I'm nice the marketing to meet you. manager here. Maurice Allen. This is the Drumlin putting course. It's a 12 hole putting course for overnight guests. It's eliminated, so you can play until 11.30 at night. The putting course itself acts like the big course. It rolls and dips and dives. It's just like what you'll see today. So what makes Aaron Hills so special? We've hosted a number of USGA championships, including the US Amateur, US Women's Public Links, US Open, and soon the Mid-Amateur Championship. It's a public access facility, and our caddy program is basically unmatched. We have 150 caddies. We take a lot of pride in having a special experience, even though anyone and everyone can come to play. Avery, everything slopes hard right to left. Right center is great. There we go. Perfect. Ooh, nice. Love it. There you go. Par four, 440 yards. Good swing. From green to tee box, like it's eight and a half miles straight down the fairways. It's a hike. Please be the best shot of my life. There it is. Good out. Thank you. What year was this course built? 2006, actually. So what is this bell right here? That bell is actually from a blind par three that we used to have. The sides of this bell right here, the arms of it, this is how they created the logo for the course. Party time. Be the oh. number. Perfect. That is perfect. Ooh, two good golf shots. Wow, oh. two peas in a bud. Let's have a chance. Stay up, stay up. Oh. Oh my gosh! I thought I had that. That looks so good. Yes! Let's go! Woo! Good bird. That's the way I do it. All right, here we go. Last hole of the day. The mile long par five. Mile long, all right. 75. 75, I like That's it. That's a hike. So tell us what we're looking at here. This cool little plaque, clover. This is JT's plaque, Dustin Thomas, from the US Open. Cool. 2017. This is where he hit the three wood shot off the tee to here, and then he actually hit another three wood to that green way out there, which is 302 yards away, onto a, like a false front there to eight feet for eagle, wow. which he made for course record of 63. So it was the best shot he's ever hit in his life. That was hit really well. There it is, great shot. Go! Come on, partner. Hey! There it is. Here we go. Birdie. All right. Birdie. Aaron Hills was definitely a treat with you, so thank you. Hey, you guys it. made it fun and easy. <laughs> Today's not over yet. Okay. We're gonna do another sport today, a little something different, but I'm gonna keep it a surprise. Keep going your toes. I have no clue what I'm getting into, but I'm going to trust you. All right, I love it. Let's go. That was fun. That was a great performance by you at the end. Thank you. I really got it together. Hi, guys. Hey, man. How's it going? Hey, how's it going? Going well. Welcome to Casamibo, where the fun never stops. It's bowled just like regular bowling. Like regular bowling, you have 10 frames? Yes, 10 frames, and then obviously if you don't get your strike, you get your second ball to pick it up. The pins have to be manually set by someone back there. Yes, I do have neighborhood kids set the pins. Okay. Yes, that's kind of what brings everyone in, is the nostalgia of it is that most of the money is going to the neighborhood kids. Well, show us some ropes, let's do it. Don't be shy, get at it. Oh, you were way more aggressive with this. 
What year did you say that the actual lanes itself were built here? 43. Oh, wow. There you go, get that strike. Let's go! The champ is here. Yeah, she wasn't listening to that comment. Strike. Oh, no, no! <laughs> so what we got here is something huge. You're only up five, Maurice, so it's gonna be close either way. Well, there it is. And that's the game, ladies and gents. It feels so good. Turkey time! <laughs> well, that's a wrap on day two. All right, good day. I lost, but not happy about it. Last day in Milwaukee. Yeah, we're headed to the home of the Greater Milwaukee Open, which was a PGA Tour event, which was last played in 2009 at Brown Deer Park Golf Course. And it's always been a municipal course so that the public could get to play where the pros play. Tiger Woods played his first ever PGA Tour event there, so it's a really special place. All right, Avery, well, here we are. Another nine holes. Mm -hmm. I'm hitting the two iron here because this course is extremely short. Yeah, just around 6,700 yards. The PGA Tour, they played here for 16 years. look at three of the major faces of black golf, there's Jim Thorpe, Calvin Pete, and Lee Elder. They all won here. Calvin won twice. Wow. So it's pretty, pretty interesting to be in the same city where so much history for black golf, especially with the resurgence of the black golf renaissance that's happening now in professional golf. 202 here, but there's something super special about this whole Tiger Woods first event he ever played, PGA Tour event. He holed it out. So we got a hole in one in 1996 on this hole. Come on, Wynn, give me a little love. No hole in one for me though. This is our last hole of this course and let's see what we can do. All right, let's go tee it up. On our whole voyage of 72 and 72, we've seen resort courses, we've seen corporate courses like East Lake. Yep. Now you have a municipal golf course that obviously has a huge park system. Uh, they've got soccer fields, they got all kinds of stuff going on here where the whole community can be a part of it. It really shows that golf is for everybody. You mentioned the soccer fields. Yeah. And we're gonna put my soccer skills to the test. I know you have a little background, but I think we're gonna go try some foot golf. All right, it'll be a first for me. We're out here and it's definitely a little bit different, a little taller grass and the holes are much wider than a traditional cup, obviously to fit the ball. But do you know who designed this golf course? I'm gonna go with Ronaldo. Mr. Jack Nicklaus. All right, the golden bear himself. Ow. That's all, all you wanna do. Oh, that was some nice draw you put on that. Yeah, that's it. That, is, that might go in. All right, that's close. Okay, that was actually pretty very nice. horsepower as I thought and the height wasn't there so I just accidentally sort of drilled it into the water. We used a nice looking stick though to fish it out. All right Avery so here we go we are on the last hole of our 72 and 72 it is important that we finish strong. Mm -hmm. You got two kicks from here to get it into the hole for par. Let's make it happen. That's got a chance. Come on go please baby baby. Oh. Not for me though. Avery with the par. Well, that's the finish of 72 and 72. It was a great trip. We got to go to Chicago. Mm -hmm. Finished in Milwaukee. Mm -hmm. I don't know where we're going next, but I'm excited to see where we're going to end up. Same. It was a great 72. It is. Well, let's head out. Let's go.